Queer Chat, it's Cole here, and today's topic is um, about dating bisexuals as a genderqueer person. It was submitted by Sydney, and I love this topic. I think I've talked a little bit about this topic in other videos, but I'll cover it um, a little more briefly in, in different type of detail this time. Um, the topic reads, as genderqueer people, do you find yourself dating or being involved with what might otherwise seem a disproportionate number of bisexuals? If not, how does being genderqueer influence your pool of available partners and choices among them? Well, I guess I've been out as genderqueer um, probably about six years now, five years, five and a half years. And previously, before um, coming out as genderqueer, I um, found myself... Um, dating lesbians um, because that's how I was identifying at the time um, and with the exception of my first girlfriend who is again my girlfriend again now um, she is bisexual but besides her the only other serious relationships I had were with lesbian identified um, female born people um, so even when I came out as genderqueer um, I was in a serious relationship with a lesbian identified person um, although her sexuality um, has shifted um, at the time, that's how she was identifying, and that was how our relationship was set up. Um, <clears throat> so until the last year and a half or so, after I got out of that relationship, I hadn't really had experience dating as a genderqueer identified person. Um, and I guess as I've sort of become more aware of my gender identity and my panromantic type of tendencies, I found myself um, now attracted primarily to bisexuals. I mean, I have BIDAR now that just draws me to someone. I just have a sense that they are bisexual. Um, and so yeah, I'm, I, have been, I have been extremely interested in bisexual people um, since I came out of genderqueer. I think there's a, several reasons for this. Um, I know that emotionally I felt such an ease and understanding with that particular group in general um, in a romantic way. Um, I think that's because, first of all, bisexual people, I'm also including pansexual in this discussion, even though it's not exactly the same thing. I think that most bisexuals they call themselves bisexuals are probably pansexuals. It's just pansexual is a more inclusive term. Um, so I'm going to kind of lump it together, even though I know that they're different. Um, I think, I, I, I have a feeling that most bisexuals would say that they're pansexual if they knew, you know, that meant. Um, so bisexual people are generally going to be interested in sort of varying degrees of the gender scale. Um, it seems like most bisexuals don't see the world in terms of bodies, um, but more in terms of energy, connection, um, things that are less tangible than bodies. Um, and I think that that's much like gender variant people perceive gender in the world around them that way, sort of in terms of energy and connection instead of bodies. Um, so I think that's one thing that brings the two groups together. Um, another thing that I've noticed is bisexual individuals typically are more open to the idea of physical fluidity and physical or an emotional fluidity um, because they themselves enjoy aspects of both or all bodies, um, both or all emotional intensity levels. I mean, I think that that's another reason why um, genderqueer people and bisexual people work in a romantic way a lot of the time is because genderqueer people, you know, although there's varying degrees, of course, of how different genderqueer people identify, um, you know, there is 
some fluidity there or you wouldn't be identifying as genderqueer. So, or at least neutrality. Um, so I think that because a bisexual person can enjoy <clears throat> different types of, you know, emotional entity, different types of physical um, bodies, that um, that is a way to free a genderqueer person because they don't necessarily have to live up to any expectation in that way. Um, another thing I've noticed about being enjoying being with bisexual people as a genderqueer person is that physically I'm much more compatible with bisexual people. Um, I think this is because bisexual people have never made me feel like they're concerned about my genital status or, you know, how I'm presenting or anything. Um, and I know when I dated lesbian identified people, I kind of always felt an underlying amount of pressure um, to be, a, you know, a girl for them because lesbians enjoy women. That's why I don't identify, you know, as a lesbian because I don't feel like a girl. So that doesn't make sense for me personally. Um, but I always felt pressured by that community to be more femme. Um, and that really wasn't who I was or how I wanted to identify. I truly feel kindred to the bisexual community. I think genderqueers and bisexuals share a common thread. And I think that common thread is having an open mind and an open heart to different bodies, different gender expressions, different forms of sexuality. You know, I think that our hearts and minds are the most open in this society. And I just adore the bisexual community. So, yay, go bys!